Well, the wait is finally over. TV's number one daytime drama, The Young and Restless, returns today with all new episodes. Actors Crystal Khalil and Jason Thompson star on the show. I spoke with them about filming in this age of social distancing and what will be happening in Genoa City. It's a little bit different, but I would say over the months, um, once we kind of started to gear up a little bit. I don't know how long production took to kind of put all these protocols in, but it was a while and we would get updates as we go. And um, I think uh, I can speak for Crystal that everybody feels safe and it's really, really nice to be back. It's a little bit different, but we're trying to do everything we can to make sure that it doesn't necessarily look and feel any different to the viewer. <laughs> how do you start and ramp up? I mean, is there going to be like a recap of where you left off before everything was shut down? Yeah, we're at Chancellor Park celebrating the uh, the, the memorial, uh, Catherine's memorial, and so Billy and Lily are interviewing everybody. And as we're interviewing them, they're having flashbacks of okay. of what happened before. So that will just kind of help, you know, get the viewers up to speed. As far as um, the storyline, I mean, uh, what's brewing for your particular two characters? Well, uh, Jill put us both in command of Chancellor Communications as co-CEO, so we'll butt heads and we'll um, we'll do what we do best and kind of um, you know rile each other up a little bit, which will be, which will always be fun. And there's a lot going on. Obviously, there's um, there's going to be some a, a mystery with the Abbots that's going to kind of start to unravel, and the Newmans will be involved. And you know, obviously, Victor will be in there mixing things up. So we're going to do what we do best, probably. Not as intimate as we usually are, but uh, still, we'll, we'll throw some punches at some place. And you can catch The Young and the Restless today and every weekday at 1230 right here on CBS3.